Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rosa and I'm going to show you how I achieved these curls using a flat iron. So I already straightened my hair, so definitely check out the video linked above on how I straightened it. And I'm just going to be showing you guys how I curl it with the flat iron. I did lower the flat iron temperature to 350. I'm just curling my hair and it's already straight, so I don't need it to be super duper high. And basically what I'm doing is wrapping my hair around one of the sides of the flat iron and working it, working that um, flat iron slowly down to the ends of my hair. And I'm going to show you guys a couple more shots of me doing this so you can get the hang of it. So here we go. And the position, you want it to be in a position where you are comfortable, like for me, it was easier on the other side of my hair versus this side. I'm struggling with this side. But basically, I'm closing the flat iron like normal, and then I'm going to turn the flat iron around a complete 360. And you're going to see I'm back on the side of the flat iron that I started and my hair is now wrapped around one of the sides of the flat iron, which causes it to curl once I release it. And they give you really nice bouncy curls. Um, you know, and you can do this with any flat iron, you know, the bigger the flat iron, the bigger the curl. So I'm going to pause the video. So you guys can see that you see this side of the flat iron. I'm going to basically turning the flat iron so that my hair is wrapped around one of the sides and I'm bringing it right back to where it started and then moving it down my hair. So this is the last clip I'm going to show you in regular speed. The next speed is going to be even slow down some more so that you can really see what I'm doing. All right, so now an even better view. I got my flat iron. Closing it. Wrapping the hair around it while turning the flat iron a complete 180. Once it's back to the side that it started on, easing it slowly down the strand of hair. And that is how I achieve these curls. I thank you guys so much for watching. Please just give this video a big thumbs up if you found it helpful. I'm also gonna be editing and putting up a video on how I maintained the curls all week. So stay tuned for that. I will see you guys in my next video.